station. You got the praise man, Robert Praise Man, Washington, standing next to my friend. I say that my friend, he's just not an artist, man, because we started off this thing together back in the day. You know, we were about a couple pounds lighter. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm saying, God is true, blessed, all this was black. But uh, what I'm trying to tell you, man, I just have to start off like this. God has been good to us. Yeah, yeah, he has, man. It has been amazing. You know, when I was just sitting back um, just last week, just really reflecting on how good God has been as I see so many artists and, you know, ministers trying to uh, be recording artists. And I just look at my own life and how God has truly blessed me to have um, man, already four songs in the top ten. Yes. And, and my, yes. In my career with the blood, you survived, I wouldn't know you, and I trust you. So, man, I, I'm just, I thank God, man, and God's been good to you. You are, man, you are blessing so many. You don't even realize. It. It's kind of like, you know, both of us, when, when stuff yeah. goes on the air, we don't know the lives that are being touched. Right, right, right. But, man, to, to see how you minister, you pray with people, that you're not just a radio announcer, but you're a minister of the gospel yeah. uh, who happens to be a radio I, announcer. I, I love that, too, with yourself. Um, I love to see you when you go out there on stage. You're not just out there performing. It's that anointing and that performance that makes the difference. But I look at you, um, I won't say struggle, but you really want people to get that message. I was just looking at you outside, and you were like, look, I know we got some young people out here. Y'all want a stanging leg and do all that. You know, which, okay, we understand. We was once young. But you, you got that saying, like, I really want... In your young life, I want you to really know Christ, man. Yeah, because I understand that when you don't have Christ, it doesn't, you know, the Bible says that, you know, what is it, man? To, what is it, profit man, to gain the whole world yeah. and lose his soul, man? You can lose everything, yeah. but if you have Jesus, the odds are still in your favor. Yeah. The Bible says if God before you, you know, He's more than the world against you. So yeah. even at the young age, if they can get connected to Jesus and be serious about that, everything else in their life will prosper. Man, God bless you. One last thing, man. I really think what you do. I thank you for what you do. You open up your life. Um, because in the story, you know, you survive, I trust you, all those songs, you talk about your personal experience. And a lot of us as Christians, you know, we're not there yet. We're like, I don't want everybody to know I'm busy. I don't want everybody to know that I almost lost my home or I lost my home and I had to stay in the motel. But man, you you have put it all out there, man. Why? I think because that 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 encourages other people. And you know what, at first I didn't want to, but God was like, you need to, you know, you need to show people your scars so they can know that the same way I brought you out, I can bring them out. Because a lot of times they see you, number one song, like, oh, you know, his yeah. life has been wonderful. Yeah. Yeah. But they don't know, realize, uh, less than four years ago, me and my family were homeless, and we didn't have a car, and we didn't have money, and we were struggling to eat from day to day. Oh, and yeah. But to see what God has brought me now, let somebody else know that the same way God did it for James, he can do it for me. Man, one last thing, um, to just encourage other young artists out there that's trying to get out there, um, trying to get to a James Fortune level. What would you like to tell them? Uh, I wanted to, to remember to not tack on prayer, but let prayer be the main thing. Start everything off with prayer and continue to remain humble. You know, continue to realize that whatever you accomplish, whatever you gain, it's only going to be by the grace of God. Everything that we have is connected to grace, so to God be the glory. Oh man, James Fortune and Fire, your live at Family Fun Day. Thanks, Houston. Oh,